What's up everybody on YouTube? Thanks for tuning in today. If you are tuning in, if you're not tuning in, then you didn't see this video, which is very unfortunate because, yes, these shoes are a little bit old. They are maybe, I think they came out around the all-star break for the NBA, which we haven't had the NBA in quite a while, which is very disheartening for me because I absolutely, while I'm an NFL fan, I absolutely love the NBA playoffs because that's when the best performances come out. You know what I mean? It's mano y mano, best talent, best of seven, best team wins. But anyways, not to get off track, I got something really special in here. And the best part about it is these shoes aren't for guys. So, as you can see, these are a woman's shoe. I had to get them in a size 13, which actually equivalent to a 11 and a half. I wear a size 11, which is still cool. It's still room for comfortability, but let me show you what's inside. If you don't already know, some people might already know. These, a woman's shoe. I got them for me because these are fucking absolute fire. I mean, like, I'm not a big shoe person, but now these, like, change things for me because these are sick as fuck. While the guys got the, uh, I think they're called the Fearless UNC or something like that. They're white and they're, um, they have that patent leather. I think that's absolutely garbage. But the women, uh, so first of all, you get black laces. Gone. Gone. Absolutely gone. Because me, I have to either do white or red laces because the black laces weren't cutting it for me. Uh, I think the white laces look better, but I just wanted to kind of just throw in. I did a pretty piss poor job on the laces, but um, I just wanted to kind of throw them in just to see. Like, I love the white or the red laces on these. The black, the black laces, I think it's a little bit too much black in there. So I kind of wanted to just, you know, lighten them up a little bit. But anyways... These things are absolutely fire. Me as a Duke fan, I'm not a big fan of the, the UNC blue, but it's just from this to the black to the red, it even has like the bread toe look from the front. These things are absolutely fire, man. I swear, if you don't have these as a guy, go get you a pair because the price is going hella up right now because I snagged them while they were still a good price about like $50 ago from what the price is now. So I originally bought these thinking I was going to flip them. But once I got them and put them in my hands, these are, these are fucking staying with me. Unless, unless these go up to about 500 bucks, these are fucking staying with me and they're on their way to that. But um, yeah, so let's get into it. First thing first, this leather quality, this is the best leather quality I think on any Air Jordan. I don't know, there's a billion Air Jordan ones, but this leather quality is absolutely fascinating. It's like you could live in this shit. It is so soft and comfortable, plush. Um, as you can see, got the red toe, again, black outer lacing with the toe. White sole, well, I'm sorry, midsole. Got the red bottoms. These are absolutely fascinating. Don't mind the stock X tag, it's never took it off, but yes, it does come with the little Nike Air tag, little leather tag. Red Nike Air on the tongue. Made in Viet Cham. As in Vietnam. Um, inside of the left foot, you got the blue. Inside the right foot, you got the red. Ah, I just I can't get over these. These are these are absolutely fascinating. I do have an on feet video of these that I could drop if you guys want to see. Um, if you don't want to see, that's that's also fine too. I'm just this offering um i think i might take the red laces out i'm not too sure i did i can also leave a link for these laces i got these off of ebay uh 72 inches um which do come about all the way from what i did with doing the uh i forget what this lace is called i looked up some videos online just to 
just to try to see different ways to lace up Jordan instead of just the normal way. You know, you can do, you can do the bottom, you can do the mids, you can go all the way to the top. I, I forget what this exact design is called, but uh, it's pretty nice. Uh, I think I will switch eventually these red ones out and put both white laces in. I don't even want to put these on my feet and wear them to fuck them up, but I just, I absolutely love these. For them being women's shoes, I'm, I'm pretty jealous, and that's why I had to go buy myself a pair of women's shoes. Um, another thing I think is, a, is I all, it seems like all Nike shoes do this, but I just always love that they put the little stars on the toes for the grip. That just fascinates me with all Nike shoes. I think that's incredible. Um, I don't know really what else to talk about. You got your, got your uh, Black Air Jordan logo, which is nice. I'm glad they didn't make it white or any other color. The black makes it look really good on there. Nice little print. Yeah, uh, I don't know if this video did any justice for you, but I absolutely hope if you really care you go get yourself a pair of these shoes. These are absolutely fascinating. Um, yeah. Honestly, I'm kind of out of things to talk about. I just wanted to... I've been holding on to these for about a month now and just been super excited. I just always look at them and I'm like, damn, these are just absolutely fascinating. What a lovely shoe to have besides the UNC Blue. Uh, it, it does look good on this shoe, but I absolutely hate North Carolina. Fuck the Tar Heels, they're fucking pieces of shit. But, obviously, we got Chicago in the front, that's all we're worried about, okay? Um, thanks for viewing this video. Uh, please like, share, and subscribe. Uh, do whatever you can to, to get this video surfaced around, or, or at least enjoy it to yourself. I, like, I hope I did some justice for these shoes because these are fascinating. Get a pair. Get a pair, seriously, right now before these prices jack sky up because then you're fucked and you're not going to get a pair. And like I said, they're women's. These are women's shoes. So for men, they go up to, I think, a size 15 in women's, which is, I think, a size 13 or whatever in men's, 13 and a half in men's. So if you don't have these as part of your collection, you got to get them now, please. Um... Yeah, that's it. That's it for the video. I'm out. Like, again, uh, like, share, and subscribe if you want. Whatever. If not, and fuck you. I don't even know why you waste your time watching this whole video if you weren't going to. I'm just kidding. Um, yeah, thanks, everybody. Have a good day.